Hello and welcome, I'm Marco, let's play Europa Universalis 4. We are playing as the Golden Horde trying to unlock the Great Khan achievement. In the last episode we won a war against, against Muscovy. Muscovy is now very puny, very small, and it's probably gonna end up being eaten by Tver and Novgorod, Tver is a vassal noob, so I think Muscovy uh, is gonna suffer for what they try to do to us. Um, we are going to beat up uh, Muscovy, uh, sorry, um, the Timurids in this episode, I hope. We, we need to do it uh, quickly. Or else we are gonna have to deal with plenty of rebellions up here. Maybe I should not care with the local autonomy and uh, simply increase it. Screw the vassal. This reduces the chances of of the rebels spawning while we are busy in down here. I just hope no guy does not cancel the military access. Because if they do it, I might be forced to declare war. Go, speed this up. You go to that fort. Or simply over there. Sure. Damn events. I think I should boost it again, but it's too expensive. I'm worried with the possible possibility of a peasant's war. Let's go help out our little vassal. We have their capital. Go siege stuff. They have a ticking war score because. Oh, well, this was stupid. I used the wrong CB. I used the conquest CB. But this is gonna give me a shit ton of uh, aggressive expansion and. And I'm gonna have to pay Diplo power for the provinces that I'm gonna take. Not a huge deal. Being plagued by being plagued by rebels as usual. They barely have an army. Okay, since I don't want to micro this too much, let's do this. And split the stacks in half. These stacks are pretty big. Still stuck at military tech. Crap. 
They stack a military attack 4. Uh, 3. Not 4. I want, that, I want to take that fort, but that stack is pretty big. If we can... Still win. Some reinforcements. I think we can. They have the same tech of uh, the Timurids. She's crap at this point. Uh, they have a crap leader in charge too. So we are gonna win this fight. Well, we are gonna fight in mountains, so that sucks. We are gonna win the fight and uh, take, o take over the siege. somewhere else Timurid tribes, Timurids um, tender rebels just well well at least they helped us siege that. So that's good. And more pretender rebels. Go back. You're gonna get a shit ton of war score after the Bukhara falls. And it fell. Go after another fort. Well, this is uh, this siege barely started. I'm gonna face seven calf in mountains, so this gonna this is gonna end badly, I think. Let's see. No, they have pretty low morale. And the garbage general. Twenty eight percent war score. Well, they are even at war with Sweden. Good luck. It's a shame that this is gonna fall to the tribes. I'm gonna be attacked by another rebel army. We only have 29 war score, that's not enough for my... for the efforts. Love the power projection, by the way. 89. Don't love the way I'm, I'm, using, I'm losing dosh, but we can still handle it for a, while, a little while. Longer. Well, 
they are they were very lenient towards towards Muscovy. They lost three provinces only. that little army over there. The Ottomans decided to give us some subsidies. Again. They have clicked the damn event. Because now this is gonna take forever. into a big sack and then go beat up the tribes. Anything here of our religion? These rebels are gonna force me to sign a peace treaty with the Timurids with uh, so little war score. Yes, please. Tribes are giving me trouble. Rebels and rebels and more rebels. Okay, you are pushing it. You're really pushing it. Another fort has fallen. I think we need to kill that uh, big stack from the tribes. So let's bring the big army and uh, kill these rebs. Kind of wasting your time over there. Wait a little bit. Okay, nice. Black wipe. He 
Emirates have a shit ton of forts. Okay, sit tight. And uh, let's go kill those guys. And uh, use this stack much further, in a much further, more effective way. Over here there are, there are too many forts. Maybe you can go over there. With some major luck, we'll get there before the, the siege, the fort falls. Let's believe. Yeah, sure. At least they didn't have much time to, they won't have much time to reinforce it, so... Hello, war score. 53% because the capital, capital has fallen. You were in the 30s, I believe, before the capital. Well. Hundred troops. Interesting. Almost ten ten years at war. Seldom do this. Very very rare. Since we don't have enough troops, let's leave the forts. Let's let uh, let's leave some troops on top of the fort and go siege the other provinces. Soon we'll have the call for peace. Pretty sure of that. Harsh treatments. Teach something else. Ahead of time. Very, very nice to see that. Okay, no point going back because of that. Let's go for a fort. That one. If I can, they are gonna lose 100% war score worth of provinces. Very nice, go up there.
Hello, Team Reeds. Right here, go there, you go over there. Um, uh, province is occupied by Tabaristan. Let's see oh, what are they willing to give us. Sixty-six percent, not enough. Guess I'm gonna have to do more harsh treatments. Pretend the rebels. All for peace is just around the corner, unfortunately. Hopefully these pretenders will go try to siege the forts. Sorry, the micro is not on where I want it. It is up a bit. Yep, they're going after the forts. So we were cool. We're good. I'll take that. Crap, forgot about um, these guys. I talked about doing another Arsh treatment and completely forgot to actually do it. Let's wait for another four to fall, then go. Actually, we don't have time for this. Yes, we do. This means 92% over extension. That's three, 95. Seven of extension. Yeah, we can't wait. Let's finish this. That's good enough. Raise it. Looks like that's already the minimum. Yep. 
and of course increase the local autonomy. Bring these guys home. I have to do it this way. Because I don't have military access through no guy. Rid of the fort. And let's uh, release a vessel. Firm. And uh, give it, give him uh, uncourt provinces. That one. I can't give that this one because it's being sieged by rebels. We'll see. Actually, I can. Nice. Okay, um, I'm gonna take a break. Thanks for watching and take care.